Hello everyone, welcome back to Two Minute Teacher Tech. My name is Adam Howard and today I want to show you a Google Docs add-on called RyQ. What RyQ is, is an essay grading add-on uh, and it's definitely one of the most helpful that I found for helping you to quickly grade essays. To get started what you need to do is go right here to add-ons when you're in a Google document. I've copied and pasted a uh, piece of student work here so we can use it as an example. Um, we're going to hit get add-ons and then you just type in RyQ. See if that works. Here we go. And then you're going to hit the plus button. Choose your account. There we go. Now, when you go up here to add ons, oh, got it up. there we go. All right. So now, when we go up here to add ons, you're going to see RyQ right here. And you're going to hit show. And it's going to pop up right over here. What this is going to do, oh, it's going to have you register. All right, there we go. Now, this is what you're going to see from now on. When you click on the add-on, you're going to go down to RyQ, and you're going to hit Show RyQ, and then it's going to pop up this right here. Now, it's going to show you the name of the writer, their grade level, and then you're going to choose a genre. This is a narrative. There we go. And then you hit Score this document. Wait for the magic to happen, and boom, there you go. All right, it's going to show you the word count, sentence count, Words per sentence, vocabulary maturity age, which is really good. I really like that piece of information with my English language learners. Uh, correct word sequence, incorrect word sequence, and time spent writing. Now, obviously, I copied and pasted this from a piece of student work. Um, here you'll see how long the student spent writing this, um, which is pretty cool. So you can see how much effort they put in. Um, and then you have the writing score up here at the top. Okay. Now you can scroll through here and look and see if you agree or disagree. And if you click these, you can clear the errors if you feel like it's being a little too aggressive in marking errors. Um, it's a spelling error. Okay, so uh, actually that's going to be a grammar error. They didn't capitalize the name. So anyway, so you can work through the document. And then you're going to hit next, and it's going to pull up this rubric. It's going to show you the different areas that it grades on. And then you can come through here and click individually. Uh, the response uh, itself, let's say almost at grade level, okay, and you can come through here and score it by hand, or you can score the whole thing, uh, all the organization at once. You can just click this one. Uh, narrative techniques, almost grade level, and then the language, almost grade level, and then we can come through here and modify this a little bit, all right, and then hit save once you're satisfied with it. All right, and that's going to give you this little readout right here, and then you can leave a comment. All right, and then you are going to hit confirm. And what it's going to do is it's going to put that score sheet right at the top of their page here as a JPEG. So next time they open this document, um, or if they go to Google Classroom and they open the document, they're going to get this feedback sheet right here on top of their essay. All right, now we have the, the score down here at the bottom. If we want to just import that into our grade book or send that feedback through Google Classroom, we're able. All right, there you go. Very simple, very easy to use add-on for grading essays. I hope you found this useful. If you have, please hit like and subscribe below. Each week, 2-Minute Teacher Tech will bring you the latest in classroom technology and teacher hacks in a concise and easy-to-follow way that respects your time budget. Thanks, and we'll see you next week.